today. I'd go for Belgium. Chris Ward. Burnley. Emphasizing again the FIFA edict. He said he dipped. Yeah, 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 right. He, he dipped. He dipped. And that's going to be a card, and the red is out. The red is out by Hugh Dallas. The Scottish referee has sent Pardo off after 28 that minutes. That sucks. <laughs> Fancy World Cup live. Uh, later on, we'll be recreating a great World Cup moment with the fabulous Eusebio. And we'll be saying a big hello to David Peckham. Hello, I'm David. <laughs> no, 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 no. We've, we've, we've dropped him. Yeah, we have dropped yeah. him, yeah, obviously. <laughs> but he was called David Peckham. He actually, there he is. That's David Peckham. <laughs> and uh, as you see, while he was in the photo booth, David had a stroke. <laughs> can't say. It's called David Peter Peckham, which is like the old Peter Peckham picture. Anyway, good news about Eusebio. You've got you say, the real Eusebio. He's on, on the, the show. show. After that, which is brilliant. When I was a kid at school, you said this song, right? used to go, We all agree, Astol is better than Pelly, Bobby Hope is better than Eusebio, so why don't we go on the telly? Good. <laughs> No, but I did, I did go, I took yeah. their advice, I went on the telly. Yeah, where are the rest of them? They haven't turned up yet. Oh, God. <laughs> anyway, let's get on. A few things first. We've noticed from watching the World Cup over the last couple of days. With all the controversy over refereeing decisions, a word of advice to officials. If you have become a bit unpopular with the crowd during the game, try not to look too pleased to see the police escort. <laughs> And Eurosport commentator Archie McPherson took time out from his commentary today to rehearse for his role as the new Darth Vader. They're lacking guile, but certainly lacking nothing in spirit. <sighs> oh, see, you're right. And with the Colombian camp in disarray off the pitch, it's good to see that where it counts, their biggest stars have lost none of their old skills. <laughs> and thanks to Alan Hansen for giving us an insight into what Mark Overmars likes for breakfast. Is it the Overmars?